Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I have a beautiful box to show you. It's not really in a box, but I've taken it all out. But it is called the Awesome Sauce Indie Box. And they have a they have a Facebook group, and that's how I found them but she has sent me this to let me review it and I am excited about it um, but what they do is they take there's four main if I'm not mistaken there's four main indie brands that always contribute to it every other month and then they always have a feature polish um, from another indie brand so you get this card and it this is the four that that it that is always in it. You got Anonymous Lacquer, Lavish Polish, Ever After, and Vapid. And I mean, and they do themes. This theme is Barbie Girl. It's a Barbie box. Um, and you get this with it and it lists all the, the different brands that are in the um, box. And then when you turn it on the back, it shows you the theme. And this one says life in plastic and then when you open it up it tells you about the polishes I mean I absolutely love this I mean it, it's just absolutely phenomenal um, and I think all these are five free but let's jump right into it and I'm gonna show you and then I'm also gonna show you um, swatches as I'm putting them on okay so the first thing the first brand is Anonymous Lacquer, and the one she did is called Bridezilla, and it is a beautiful white curly with um, shimmer in it. I mean, just different color, beautiful, beautiful um, polish. I'm normally not one for white, but this one is just gorgeous. Sorry about that. Okay, I'm back. Um, but this one's gorgeous. At the end of the video, I will show y'all all the swatches. Okay, and the next one is Ever After Polish. And they did uh, Malibu Barbie. And it is a blue curly with hollow shimmer. I mean, just absolutely gorgeous. Um, also, I forgot to add... Um, well, let me finish with this one and then I'll go back and add to the anonymous lacquer uh, Malibu Barbie the ever after they donated all they put with it a um, Face mask Let's put this down. They they did a face face mask and it is a mask and scrub and It's got bentonite and sea clay and sea kelp in it um, I haven't opened it yet, so, but that's what it looks like on the inside. Very colorful. And the smell's not too bad. Not bad at all, actually. So, I'm excited to try this. Um, and back to Anonymous Lacquer. They also, um, contributed, uh, it's, um, Perry, a Pearberry Lotion Bar with cocoa butter oil mango but uh, mango butter beeswax jojoba oil vitamin e and fragrance and i guess you could use this for your um your cuticles that's probably what the only thing i'll use it for is because i really like to focus on those um but it's comes in this little baggie and let's open it up and see what it looks like oh wow oh and it smells phenomenal oh wow that is that oh i cannot wait to use this but that's what anonymous lacquer and ever after contributed next is lavish polish and they did this lavender curly and it's got um shimmer in it and hollow glitter 
and it's a scat it's got scattered hollows and just all kinds of stuff in it just absolutely gorgeous gorgeous lavender and that is let's go party next is vapid lacquer and it is a black polish with color shifting glass based pigment in a blue to purple shift um and they also added some micro hollow flakies in there i mean and i cannot wait to try this one this one is just absolutely gorgeous um if i didn't say the name is demolition barbie um but it is just beautiful i hope y'all can see what i'm seeing because let me see if i can zoom in here i mean look at that it is just absolutely beautiful beautiful all right okay and next is the featured polish and it is by cupcake polish and it is called barbie girl it is a hot peak a hot pink linear hollow with a slight flash of lilac i mean just look at that absolutely gorgeous gorgeous polish i mean that is just beautiful beautiful and they also had um Lew it yourself donated some um stuff and one is these barbie vinyls and let me see if i could peel one up so you can see what it looks like because you kind of can't see it let's see all right i'll be right back i'm gonna peel this up okay so i finally got it peeled up and that's you got 10 of these on this little sheet but that's what it looks like and i placed it on the back but i mean just that's so cute and they also donated these little barbie um charms i mean it, they're just absolutely adorable look at that and i mean you, you that is just oh this came from lavish polish okay i missed that one okay i missed that part these came from lavish polish but the vinyls did come from Lew it yourself um but that's them okay so you also get the featured i think I think on all of them on the featured um, polish they send a card of theirs telling you um, about their how to get with into their social media and care instructions which if you love nail polish you know how to take care of your polish um, but that all right here is the first coat of anonymous lacquer bridezilla It is a white with beautiful shimmer in there. I can see some blue and some purple. Just absolutely gorgeous. All right, that's the first coat. I am going to let that dry and then I will be back for the second coat. Here is the second shot of Bridezilla. I keep on saying shot, but I mean coat. And it looks like this one may take three because I can still see my nail bed. So as soon as this dries, I'll be back for the third coat. And here is the third coat of Bridezilla. And you could probably get away with doing um, two thick coats maybe but it's a 
beautiful white. I'm normally not one into white, but I mean, this just applied absolutely perfect. And the colors in it, I can't imagine what it's going to be like in the sun. Just absolutely gorgeous. All right, this is the first shot of Ever After Malibu Barbie. And it is on the sheer side, but it is a beautiful polish. It looks to be a jelly. Okay, and I'll be back when this dries for the second coat. Okay, here is the second coat of Malibu Barbie. And I think this may take a little bit more than two coats. And you could probably even um, coat it over a white to make it pop. Oh yeah, it's definitely gonna take more than two coats. So I'll be back once this dries. And here is the third coat of Malibu Barbie. I think I'm going to stop at three coats because I don't want to make it too thick. I can still see my nail line just a little, but not much. But it really is a gorgeous polish. I mean, as you see. And I mean, it's got some beautiful purple and silver shimmer in there. So that was Malibu Barbie. Here is the first coat of Lavish Polish. Let's go party. And it is an absolutely gorgeous purple with shimmer. And it is a little bit on the sheer side, but the formula is just, the formula is great on all these, but I mean, just gorgeous polishes. That's the first coat. And once this dries, I'll be back to do the second coat. And here is the second coat of Let's Go Party. And this might only take two coats. Let's see. It only took two coats. I mean, that is just absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. Okay, this is the first coat of Demolition Barbie. Great formula. It's a little bit on the sheer side. So we'll come in for a second coat, but it's a beautiful, beautiful polish. I love the blue sparkly in there. I don't know if y'all can see it. I mean, that is just gorgeous. Okay, I'll be back with the second coat and once this dries. Okay, and here is the second coat of Demolition Barbie from Vapid. And it looks like this is a two-coater. But I don't know if you can see it, but the colors in that is just amazing. I mean, look at that. Just perfect. Here is the first coat of Cupcake Polish Barbie Girl. And it is a beautiful pink. And I think on this one, all you need is one coat. 
I mean, just absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. And them colors. Um, but that's it. This box normally runs $50 for five full-size bottles and then $30 for um, five mini bottles. Uh, the next, she does it every other month, but the next box, which is coming up in May, this is March's box. The next box that's coming up in May, she actually said that it is gonna be a little bit higher price only because it's their anniversary box and it's gonna have a little bit more than what it normally does in it. But I will leave the link to their Facebook page down below and I will leave a link to their actual website to buy the box when it comes available. Um, this is just an awesome box. If you are just getting into indie brands and you wanna try out different ones or if you just love indie brands in general, this is an awesome box for that. Um, Miranda, the one who does the box, is absolutely amazing. She's such a sweetheart, um, but she does such a great job on these boxes, and they're just absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous. And to all the indie makers, they just do phenomenal jobs on these polishes. Um, they all have like great formulas and just glide on so easy. Um, but yeah, that's the Awesome Sauce Indie Box. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. And I will see y'all back here on the next video. Have a good night.